Susan, how's it feel to be nominated by the Fountain Valley Chamber of Commerce? Oh, it's great to be recognized. You know, we all need a little pat on the back once in a while. And uh, uh, I'm so grateful to the Chamber and especially my sister from another mister, uh, <laughs> Allie Johns. A uh, big thank you to her. I really appreciate the nomination. And uh, it's, it's great, this Leadership Excellence Award. It, it means a lot to me, and so does she. So thank you very much, Allie. Tell us a little about yourself. Well, uh, I am the daughter of a Marine and a Navy veteran. Uh, my dad was a New York firefighter. He died at the scene of a fire. Uh, when I was nine, my mom raised the eight of us by herself. So if I have leadership qualities or I exhibit them, it's because I learned from the very best. I hear you're very generous with the community. What, what events do you support? Uh, there's a scripture in Luke, to whom much is given, much is expected, uh, or much is required. Some of the things is the Mr. V Fountain Valley pageant. Uh, my CEO, Frank McDowell, was the first Mr. Fountain Valley. And of course now we have the uh, in perpetuity is John Etheridge. Uh, Miss Fountain Valley uh, was Jessica and Kayla both. Um, the Fountain Valley Community Foundation, the Fountain Valley Police Officers Association, yay cops. Uh, Fountain Valley Summerfest, Fountain Valley Home and Garden Show, Fountain Valley Car and Truck Show, the Special Olympics, Fountain Valley Chamber of Commerce, yay Chamber, uh, Fountain Valley Bowl, the Pins for Kids, uh, Community Shredding Events, Concerts in the Park, Movies in the Park, the Tank House, Fountain Valley Community Parade, the Boys and Globe, uh, Girls uh, Golf Tournament, Fountain Valley Women's Club, yay Women's Club, um, I also write a column for the Fountain Valley Living Magazine, uh, Real Estate. Uh, that's about it, I think. Very that's nice. enough, right? Yeah, I think <laughs> you definitely support Fountain Valley community. Thank yeah, you so much. Yeah. So tell us about your business. So a few years ago, Brad Gaston, uh, one of our uh, planning commissioners, dubbed me the queen of Fountain Valley Real Estate. I gladly ascended to that throne. Uh, and I'm not abdicating anytime soon. Uh, when I have clients that relocate to, to, from out of state, I tell them, sell the snow shovel, hang up the umbrella, ditch the bug spray, and welcome to paradise. Because where else are you gonna find this, right? So uh, I, as I said, I'm, I'm a daughter of veterans, so I show up, I do my job, I work hard, I'm very responsive uh, to my clients, I always tell the truth, I do what I say I'm going to do, and I'm a tireless advocate for my clients. You see this face? This is the face of Fountain Valley Real Estate. Hello! I'm not humble, but I'm grateful every day. And I thank God, uh, I always have an attitude of gratitude towards my life and that's, the, that's why I'm able to give what I do because I'm blessed and I know it. My website is foundvalleyliving.com and my email is susan at foundvalleyliving. Well, thank you for your time. Before we wrap up, is there anything else you wanted to add? Uh, yes, first of all, I want to thank the Chamber very much for supporting me again, Ali. Thank you very much for nominating me. Uh, I love my, my peeps. I do want to say one thing I didn't mention before is uh, every escrow I close, $500 goes to our school foundation, Fountain Valley School Foundation. So keep those referrals coming. I'll do a fabulous job for your friends, your family, and uh, by doing so, you'll support our schools. So, here, here for the Fountain Valley School Foundation. Um, I, I also uh, save the best for last. He's a very honorable and kind man. Uh, he's my hero in big ways and small. Chief 
Kevin Child said he's going to have a medal made for him. Uh, Pankaj Sarastri, I thank you for your love and incredible support, and I couldn't do what I do without you backing me. So uh, he's a very private fellow, but he's married to me, so go figure. Thank you, honey. I love you. Thank you.